Feels good to be home. So how's you the play going? <laughs> I'm nervous. Why? Because. What if people actually show up? Well, fuck them. Uh, are you nervous about what people might think? I'm nervous to be up on a stage and perform in front of people. I, I'm terrified. <laughs> Look, they should be so lucky to see this play. You're, it's going to be incredible. I, I can't wait. I can. Time you leave in the morning. 6.45. Yikes. Mm-hmm. Boise. Boise? Yeah. You should come. To Boise? Why not? Cross it off your bucket list. I wish I could. Why can't you? Because I have to rehearse. And you can't rehearse anywhere else? Anywhere you are. Um, I guess? I mean, all my stuff is here, and my show's in a few weeks, so I guess it just doesn't really seem practical to me. Well, right, it's just, um... Well, look, I really think we should try to make an effort to see each other more. I mean, we hardly ever see each other anymore. I know, but when are you done? What do you mean? When are you done with the tour? Um, well, once we're done with the tour, then we go and record, and then we go back on tour again. What do you mean? Uh, we go on tour so we can make the record, and then we go back on tour so we can sell the record. So it's the long haul, then? What does that mean? It means it's the long haul. Like, you're going to be in this band for a long time now. Well, what did you expect me to do? I don't know. I guess I just didn't really think that... The band would... What, that you didn't think we'd be successful? No, that's not what I meant. What I meant was that <laughs> this band, you're going to be on the road for what, like years now? Feasibly, yeah. I mean, we could be on the road for years with just this record. Do you even like the music that you're playing? What does that matter? It matters if you're giving up your dream to be on the road for years. Do you like the music that I'm playing? Yes, I do. I just didn't think that you did. Yeah, well, I... I do. Now I hear that you're going to be on the road for years, and I don't know. I'm just a little bit shocked that you're Look, getting what are you doing? something so mad. Why are you doing this? What do you mean, why am I doing this? This is what you wanted from me. To be in this band? To have a steady job. Yes, I wanted you to have a steady job so that you could take care of yourself and start your club. And that's what I'm doing. So why aren't we celebrating? So why aren't you starting your club? You're the one that told me that no one would go to a club called Chicken on a Stick. So change the name. And no one likes jazz. Not even you. Yes, I do like jazz now because of you. So what am I supposed to do then, huh? Keep playing Jingle Bells while I save money on the side for some Shangri-La club that no one's going to go see? People will want to go to it. People love what other people are passionate about. Not in my experience. You know what? It doesn't matter anymore. It's time to grow up, you know? This is what I am doing. And if you had a problem with this, then you should have told me earlier before I signed on the goddamn line. You had a dream that you were sticking to. That was important. This is my dream. This is not your dream. Guys like me can spend their whole lives and not have anything to show for it. I'm actually doing something that people enjoy. What is wrong with that? Why the hell do you care so much about being like? What the fuck do you care? You're just a goddamn actress. You know, maybe you actually liked it better when I was a failure. Because then you could feel a little bit better about yourself. Are you fucking kidding me? No. Fuck you! Be a waste! I never want to see you again, you fucking asshole!